have been chosen to go to a different school. Arjun Pet. Een speciale dag is het vandaag, want een deel van de acteurs van de nieuwste Disney film Descendants is hier in Amsterdam. Normaal zijn het volwassenen die vragen stellen, maar vandaag zijn het... Arno en Laura. Ze zitten op de International School in Hilversum, spreken dus hartstikke goed Engels, want dat doen de acteurs ook. En zij gaan de vragen stellen. Zijn jullie er klaar voor? Ja. Ja. Goed, cool. A descendant, someone who is related to a person or group of people from the past. These are the descendants of Disney's most evil villains, and this generation is rotten to the core. What was your favorite scene in the movie? My favorite scene, there are so many, but I think the most memorable one for me was um, the opening number, Rod into the Core. Right. It was the first day of shooting, so my first day on a film set. First of all, you know, first yeah. day we all dressed as our characters, as Evie and Jay. Um, and I've been dancing since I was a little girl, so to be able to dance and sing and act all in one day with Kenny and the yeah. incredible dancers that we had, it was really, it was unforgettable. Do you relate to your character in real life? Um, yeah, I think you always do in a way. Um, you know, I feel like Jay, you know, his ambition to be the best he can be. Unfortunately for him, it's stealing, but you know, <laughs> for me, it'd be in something else in acting or like creative ways. But uh, I feel like, you know, I always strive to like be the best I can be. That's true. Did, did yeah, you ever steal cool. something? Um, yeah, we won't talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? It's called stealing. It's like buying whatever I want. Except it's free. <laughs> yeah, I, t I, t I actually took a watch. He took a watch set. from the set. Yeah. <laughs> from the set? Yeah. yeah. Why? What, what are the happened? watches that This is a nice watch. <laughs> are you still hip? I do. I brought it with me, actually. I'm not wearing it right now. It's a cool yeah. watch. Okay. Yeah. But as a kid, did you ever steal something? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah. I, would, I would think so. I mean, you just like little things, too. <laughs> Never like in a store or something, no, no, no. Do you relate to your ca character in real life? I do, yeah. So in the beginning, it was hard to relate to her because she was raised so differently by such a horrible mother. But by the end of the movie, Evie becomes such a, you know, strong, independent, like beautiful girl who learns that what matters in life is not what's on the outside, but what's on the inside. And as a girl, that was a really important lesson to learn, and I learned a lot from her. Okay, and what is the relation then? You well, had an awful mother too? No, I did not. <laughs> so in the beginning... <laughs> Hi, Mom. No, in the beginning it was hard to relate to her because she had such a horrible mother and my mom raised me to be kind of who, who Evie is at the end of the movie, which is to believe mm -hmm. that you're beautiful inside, that you're strong, that you don't need a Prince Charming to save you. And she also became kind of a nerd, and I'm such a nerd, as Boo Boo knows, so... Okay. Um, what do you think... What, do, what did you think about seeing yourself in the movie theaters? <laughs> Oh gosh, when, when we saw it on the big screen at the crazy. premiere, that was, it was pretty nuts. Let's get this party started! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. We always have seen it on this, it was, it's yeah. the semi-big screen, yeah. I guess. But seeing it in the premiere, it's like, wow, look at this. It looks like, it shouldn't be a TV movie, it looks like a movie It looked the like a big movie, yeah. And I, it was the first time I had seen myself on, on a big screen before, so that was really surreal. It was so cool. We were there with our family and mm -hmm. friends, it was really special. So I've got a gossip question. <gasps> Your first kiss. Oh, God. You're good. I like you. Yeah, you're not afraid. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my first kiss was when I was 14 years old um, with uh, one of my sister's friends. <laughs> <laughs> Older? <laughs> no, my younger sister's Your younger friends. sister. Oh, that's We're funny. like almost the same. <laughs> I was actually quite old. I was 18. And I had just graduated high school. Can you believe that? <laughs> Such a nerd. Yeah, I had like zero guy friends. And it was a friend of mine that I had kind of grown up with. Um, and it was good. That's good. Yeah. Is everybody at home? It's pretty easy. I like to think I'm the fairest of them all. Beauty is pain. And uh, what about school? Did you ever get bullied? Did you ever punch someone? <gasps> <laughs> Did I ever punch somebody? <laughs> uh, not in school. <laughs> not in school? <laughs> no, I guess... Uh, I don't know. For me, is in school, I was always just, you know, more of like on the art side of things. I uh, like to make comic books in school and stuff like that. I'd get in trouble for drawing. I wasn't really like, wasn't like really popular, and I wasn't, yeah. you know, I was, I, I was just kind of was there. I guess <laughs> I don't know. It was just, 
I don't know. I didn't really go into any category. Right. I was bullied in middle school so much so that I had to leave my middle school to go to a new school. Because um, girls can be mean, as we all know. You know, kids are can be brutal sometimes. Well, but look at you now. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> I moved to a new school, made some amazing friends who just kind of loved me for who I was. And I think that's the key. Just surround yourself with people who love you for who you are. If you're weird or you're nerdy or whatever it is, and and that's great. Um, were you ever sent outside from class for doing something you weren't supposed to? Oh. No, actually. Yeah, I was. <laughs> I was once. Well, because I I don't know when I don't know what I was thinking, but I was like. Trying to make someone have like a like a weird like trying to do like a different face with their face oh, like gosh. I don't know it was, I don't know why I was, it's just weird things I don't know and I would draw all over I'd have my schoolwork and I would finish my schoolwork but then I would draw. turn it into like he's an incredible drawer actually things like that he's, he's very talented <laughs> thank you I I was actually always kind of a nerd and I always tried to be really well behaved in school but there was one time it was during dismissal and in, in our school in dismissal you had to be very quiet you couldn't talk much which makes no sense it's the end of the school day yeah, you should be able to talk right but anyways that day I was a little chatty I had like a little candy over lunch and I was a little hyper and I got in trouble for talking to my friends <laughs> and they gave me a pink slip which is like kind of like detention <laughs> and I was so nervous like I didn't know how to tell my mom I was so 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 scared and I was like I promise it'll never happen again <laughs> I'm rotten to the core core rotten to the core I'm rotten to the core core who could ask for more I'm nothing like the kid next like the kid next door I'm rotten to the I'm rotten to the I'm rotten to the core. Oh, we got a hug. Mm, thank you thank so you. much. Thank you. So thank you. So nice to meet you. Thanks. Thanks. Hope to see you guys again soon. Thank you.